Could I tell you on this resurrection day that no matter what it is, no matter what it is, you can leave them in the graveyard and come alive? Could I tell you that all those things that kept you, kept you in the graveyard, you can release the graveyard today? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And you can come alive. You can live with a clean, pure heart today. A new heart. A heart that wants to do for Jesus Christ. A heart that wants to follow Christ. You can do that today. Isn't it wonderful? When Jesus shed his blood on Calvary's cross, when he died and he dropped his head, he said, Father, forgive them. That was you. When he said, Father, forgive, he was speaking to you. He was speaking of you. He was speaking of me. No one is exempt. All of us have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. But in his graciousness, even while dying, he remembers us. He could have died anywhere along that route. But he had to finish the job for you. See, don't, don't let your mind believe this was some people in that day and time. He was speaking about you. I gave my life for thee. What has thou given to me? What he wants is your life. What he wants is a pure life. Here be young people. God wants your life. He wants your pure life. He wants you to be an example for others to follow. Don't give up now. Don't give up now. Seek him in love as Mary did. Seek him in love as Mary did. And you will watch him bring things together. You've been just struggling. Your life has just been a mess. Your life has just been a mess. From one messy situation to another messy situation. From one messy uh, deal to another messy deal. All you're doing is trying to find life. That's all you're trying to do. You don't, uh, you don't deliberately get at these bad things. You're getting them because what you're trying to find, you're better. You're trying to find something that's better. But as long as you try to do it on your own, you go from one mess to another mess. But when you allow Jesus to chart your course, good God from Zion. When you allow Jesus to chart the course, you'll find out, you'll find out soon or very soon that you'll start moving, 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 and one day you'll look back and say, oh, I've already passed all of that stuff. We have to understand Jesus is willing. He's ready to save us from wherever we are. What you have not done, look, look at me, look at me. You have not done anything so bad that God won't forgive you. I don't care what it is. I don't care what man says. God will forgive you of your sins this morning. That's why, that's why he came alive. That's why he went to the grave. That's why he shed his blood. He did it for you and I. And nothing, nothing, nothing can wash you like the blood of Jesus Christ. Nothing can do it. So I say to you this morning, I speak in your spirit. As we heard that voice in the graveyard this morning saying, Mary, that same voice is in your graveyard this morning saying, Mary, it's calling you by your name. It's telling you to live. It's telling you to live. Get out of this dead place and live. Get out of this dead place and live. That's what God is saying to you this morning. Come forth from your dead situations. I don't care what the dead situation is in your life. Come forth from it. Come forth from it. Come forth and live. Come forth and live. Christ the Lord is risen today. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He is risen today. Shouldn't you have a hallelujah chorus yourself? Should you have a hallelujah chorus? Should you be able to shout hallelujah over something? I speak in your spirit today. Mary, it's I. I'm he who is dead, but now I'm alive forevermore. And the Bible says he came forth of the grave with all power. Power over everything. Power over sickness. Power over wealth. 
power, everything came forward with it. Whatever you want, you can find in Jesus Christ. Would you trust him this morning? On this resurrection morning, would you trust him? Will you make God the center of your life again? Will you make him the central figure of your life again? Hear me, the things of this world, this world will soon fade away. Only what's done for Christ is going to last. Hear me, the things of the world will fade as, as much as you love that house. As much as you love all your investments. Let me tell you that one day all will fade away from you or you will fade away from him. It's going to happen someday. One day you will leave it or I will leave you. The only thing is sure is Jesus Christ. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. The only thing is sure is Jesus Christ. And I speak him into you this morning. I speak life into you this morning. I speak the peace of Christ into you this morning. I speak the love of God into you this morning. So that you get the love